Today, we are about 30 miles outside of Traverse City at Central Lake because we heard of a water trail that we just had to do. And the nice thing is we went and picked up this book here. It's put on by Paddle Antrim. And basically it tells you how far and how long each section of the paddle is. And this one is about seven miles long. Yeah. So I feel like it's a pretty good section and uh, we're gonna go check it out. We're here, plan is to make our way all the way up to River Park. That's where the other car is. Since we're going a further distance, we actually parked one car at the end and one at the beginning. So when we get to the end point, we can actually drive back to our other car. I'm pretty sure the smartest thing that we did today is play the wind properly. Decide to put it at our back so we don't have to paddle against it. Like right now, kind of cruising at probably a half mile an hour without even working. That's a solid technique. Way. You think we should go that way or that way? I think we should go this way. Okay, let's just go for it. Yeah. All right. It's gonna brag that it's waterproof. That's pretty nice. It is nice. Yeah, absolutely. I think it's important to remember that you're out here for leisure. So you have to make sure to take advantage of that leisure when you can. And right now, that feels about like the perfect time. part of these are your favorite? Do you like the open water or do you like the windy parts? These windy parts, I think, are what make these water trails awesome. Heading into the last lake right here. Yeah, that's an important point. If you're putting a car at one end and the other, make sure you bring the car keys for the car that you're dropping off with you. Otherwise, you're gonna be in a bad situation. 